So, welcome to Clon Melvin, where the OSS Handicap Hurdle kicks off day three of week five. And it's a three mile handicap hurdle for five year olds and upwards. And the top one is a young guy, Blue Moon, Darren Thompson. Hart has a wish, Molly at Surfer, Durkast, Thunderspark, Ghostly Shaw, Jim Murray, Dresden Dynamo, Carla Agante, Watchdog, Kevin Meenahan, Philin Ashkalani, Doug Warren, Borrehill Lad, Darren Howes, Fasson, Manon Colleek, Martin Liedem, Sea Devil. Graham Clutterbuck, Tomorrow's World, Daniel French, King Desire, Stu Gray, Trabago, James Follis and Thunder, Derek Hinton, 14 then. Been called in by the starter, short run to the first as you can see and they get to it pretty swiftly and they're all safely over the other side. Making their way towards the second, it's a fairly short run to that as well. 17 flights to be taken in all, that's the second of them taken and the one down on his nose was Dresden Dynamo. But the leader is the Grey Durkast from Thunder in a pink jacket second. And then Borough Hill lad third in the orange as they take the third flight of hurdles. The other orange jacketed runner, Fasson Melancolique, is the back marker. But it's Durkast in front then from Thunder and Borough Hill lad they're a couple of lengths clear of the main pack who are headed by Trabago then comes Fernand Ashkalani Ghostly Shores after that one Hart has a wish on Watchdog the grey tomorrow's world is wide on the track and Fasson Melancholic is still the back marker so making the way down towards the fourth then and Durkast has a clear lead of about a length and a half to Thunder and Borough Hill lad are together Gap then back to Trabago. Fellow Lashkalani's got the rail on that was outside his ghostly shore. Then Watchdog and Hart has a wish. President Dynamo's after that one and regained his equilibrium from that mistake earlier. And then Young Guy Blue Moons and that one's inside. Just following that one is King Desire. And then Tomorrow's World, the other great, is towards the back as they take number four. The back two are Fasson, Melancholique, and Sea Devil. So Durkas then. Comes to this next flight, clearing the lead. Better jump by the second horse, Borough Hill Lad, though, sees that one moves right up to within a neck. And Trabago has now moved into third as Thunder drops back into the pack. Ghostly Shore is next. Fernand Ashkalani still got a good run round on the rail. Sea Devil is the one that's struggling out in the back a little bit, about six lengths adrift of the remainder, and seemingly in some trouble and dropping further and further back. So, I guess there might be something amiss with that one as they come. Down to the next. And Borough Hill lad just about poked his head in the lead and they take that right turn and head towards that next row of hurdles that you can see in the distance. And they come to that one now and Durkast gets over it in front from Borough Hill lad second. Thunder is back in third. Then comes Trabago. Fasson Melancholique is the one that's made significant progress around the outside to move into fourth. And there goes Sea Devil at the back who's still plugging on. And over the eighth they go all safely over that one as well including Sea Devil who's now probably 12-15 lengths adrift. The Boreal lad then has come through to take it up over the ninth from Durkast in second. Thunder is third, Fasson Melancholique moved through to fourth. Then comes Trabago in fifth with Felon Ashkelon in Ghostly Shore. Dresden Dynamo on the outside then Watchdog and then a line of five of them. King's Desire tomorrow's world, Young Guy Blue Moon and a long gap back to see Devil. So Borough Hill lad and Durkas. Durkas just been pushed along to get back into the lead. And one inside the final mile and a half now. And Durkas leads. And we're losing one at the back there. Looks like young guy Blue Moon is being pulled up. And sea Devil must still be going. So Durkas then from Borough Hill lad. And we're also losing Heart Has a Wish being pulled up at the back as well. So the pull-ups have started, and there's a mile and a quarter to go as they take the tenth. And over that one, they all skip, and then all over that one, okay. Well, we're going to see Sea Devil in shot. Well, he's too far behind. Here he comes. There he goes. Sea Devil's over it. And we get a view from the stands as they see them jump. What will be the last on the next circuit? And Borough Hill lad on the outside of Durkast. Thunder in third, and Trabago just fourth. Sea Devil. There he goes. He's 30 lengths behind now though. We don't know why the jockey's persevering and thinking we'd better off pulling him up and saving him for next week. But anyway, Durkast is the leader. From Borough Hill Lad second. Thunder's trying to come between the two of those. Then comes Trabago. And Dresden Dynamo is now trying to get in. Fast on Mullon Colleague, who made good ground earlier, is now dropped right back to the back of the main group. So was running a strange race. And Borough Hill Lad and Durkast take the 12th. 
Land together with Thunder just behind them, then Trabago fourth, Fernan Ashkelani is fifth, and Drina Madrid is sixth. King Desires making some good progress as they take the 13th, and Tomorrow's World is still towards the back, so too is Ghostly Shore as they take the 14th. And a mistake by Borrowhill Lad has seen Dirkas go back into the lead with Thunder now going into second. Borrowhill Lad dropping back after that mistake. Trabago's moved into third, then now as they take the third from home, good jump there by Thunder sees that one take it up. It's Thunder then there from Dirkast and then Trabago. Then Fernand Ashkelani, Borrell Dad looks like he's going to run his race. Then Dresden Dynamo trying to get into it now. Tomorrow's World Kings Desire and Ghosty Shaw Watchdog as well. Fasson Melonka League is out of it, but it's Dirkast in the lead. Dirkast from Thunder and Fernand Ashkelani now throw down a big challenge on the outside. Here comes King Desire in the pale jacket as well as they begin to swing towards home. They've got three furlongs still to race. And it's Dirkast in the lead from Thunder in second. Felon Ashkelani is third. Little gap back to King Desire and Borrell Lad. Then comes Tomorrow's World and Ghostly Shaw. Watchdogs after that one. Trabago looks as though he might be beaten. So too does Dresden Dynamo. Fasson Melonkalik is well out of it. And Felon Ashkelani has taken it up. Felon Ashkelani then by about half a length. Coming down towards the second last flight. Felon Ashkelani, Thunder and Ghostly Shaw. The three of them together as they land over it. And Ghostly Shaw has now gone on. Ghostly Shaw by ahead from Thunder in second. Then comes Felon Ashkelani. These three a clear of Boreal Lab. This is the final flight. Ghosty Shore and Thunderland together. Ghosty Shore on the outside. Thunder on the inside. Thunder's battling back and Thunder looks a stronger at the moment. Ghosty Shore one last surge and at the line. It's just the that takes it. Ghosty Shore second. Felon Ashkelani third. Boreal Lab fourth. And King Desire ending up towards the back. And I think Thunder's just got that on the line. It's, yeah, Thunder's just about one that I think the angle pretty decent if you look where the two posts are you can see that it's not an exactly straight shot where well, I think Thunder's one let's wait and see Yep, Thunder by head for Derek Hinton. Ghostly Shaw for Jim Murray was second. Felon Ashkelani for Doug Warren was third. Borough Hill Lad for Darren Howells fourth. And Tomorrow's World for Daniel French was fifth.